Hi guys, welcome to my grocery haul video for this week. As you know, if you've been around my channel, I share with you every week all the groceries that I get. I do one pickup and my budget for each week is $200. So I have been on a roll lately staying under budget. This week in this haul, I spent $199.77. So not a bunch under budget, but still under $200. So that's a win. Uh, this is gonna be all the food that feeds me and my family. It's me, my husband, and my two boys. They are six and seven years old. So I'm gonna share with you all the meals that we're having for dinner and everything that we got. If you're new to my channel, make sure you click subscribe and always leave me a comment if you have any questions. All right, let me show you everything I got. So here are all of the groceries from my pickup from Walmart, super easy and convenient. I just drive up and they bring it out to me, which I love, and I can make my list throughout the week of everything that we need. So this is the way I do my grocery shopping and it definitely works for me. I will start over on this side. I'll show you everything and then I will share with you the meal plan. Okay, so I have two of these little cases of this bubbly water. My husband has been drinking these like it's going out of style. So I got a whole bunch to be kind of stocked up, two eight packs of that. So that'll last him a couple weeks. I got lots of fruit. We eat tons of fruit uh, around here. Strawberries, blueberries. I have um, apples over here. I get the pink lady apples, which is our favorite. Bananas. Um, over here I have our avocados for the week. We love avocados. My kids just eat it like with a spoon. Um, super good. I have some corn on the cob here. Benjamin, my seven-year-old, he asked for corn on the cob the other day and it's been a while since we've had it. So we're going to have corn on the cob this week. I have some lettuce for salad. We're going to do salads as well this week. And I just love salad when the weather starts getting nicer. It is warming up, which is so awesome. I have a gallon of, we do whole milk, um, the boys and I, and then my husband does almond milk. So I get this unsweetened 30 calories per serving almond milk, two of those. Um, a big box of popcorn. Uh, my boys just, they go through popcorn like crazy. I think it's a pretty good snack. I mean, there could be worse snacks for sure. So big box of popcorn, microwave popcorn packets, two 18 packs of eggs. We have been hard boiling eggs a lot lately. So we definitely eat a lot of eggs, scrambled eggs in the morning, and then hard boiled eggs for some snacks here and there. Um, needed some butter. One of my favorite snacks right now is edamame. Super duper good. So this is frozen and you just steam it in the bag. Really, really easy. Super high in protein, so I love it. Some bacon, definitely um, a little treat. We don't do bacon all that often, so I wanted to get some bacon. And I like to get this apple wood thick cut. It's my favorite one, it's delicious. I get, if you've been around my channel, I get every other week this collagen. I put it in my green tea and it just, it's flavorless, but collagen, really great for hair, skin, nails, joints everything. So I just add it to my tea. Totally tasteless, but gives you some extra little vitamins in there. Um, two packs of cream cheese. I always like to have cream cheese on hand in case I need to throw together an appetizer. I did two appetizers last week, so um, needed to make sure I have some backup cream cheeses. Uh, two packs of chicken breasts. Um, we grill one up. I barbecue one. Um, just kind of plain with just some seasonings on it that we use for salads and sandwiches. And then um, another one, I do a lot of different chicken crock pot recipes. If you've been around my channel, I love my crock pot. I share with you tons and tons of crock pot recipes. So I will use another pack for a few different crock pot recipes. I have a big bag of chopped walnuts. My husband put these on, he puts these on his um, yogurt uh, as a snack. Uh, pistachios, we all love pistachio snacks, like our favorite. Um, some grated Parmesan. My kids have been, they love this. They want spaghetti and meatballs every single night of the week, basically. But, I mean, we don't have it every night of the week, but they love adding this cheese to it. I got some macaroni spirals to have in the pantry in case we need quick dinners. We have super duper busy nights, so sometimes... Um, if I don't get dinner all prepped and ready to go, I can make the boys some mac and cheese while I make my dinner. And this box, the spirals, I mean, they're really cheap. It's like 54 cents a box. 
Um, but I feel like the spirals don't make as much as the regular mac and cheese of the Great Value brand. So a few weeks ago, my kids like gobbled up a box and I ended up making them a second box. Um, I guess they're girl and boys. So two boxes of those to have in the pantry if we need it. Some black beans. My husband turns everything into a burrito basically. So always have to get black beans every week. Big bag of cheddar cheese. Salami. I put salami in uh, Zachary's lunches that I send to school. Sliced cheese. We get this um, sharp cheddar. It's my favorite. Pack of that. Uh, tortillas. We were out of tortillas. So I got, this is the kind that Benjamin likes for his quesadillas, just the regular kind. And then my husband and I like the carb balance whole wheat. So it's a big burrito, big, um, I mean, big burrito size tortilla. Five carbs, absolutely love these. 110 calories, like they're really good. I got some sandwich thins here for my husband's lunches. This wheat bread for uh, my kids' school lunches. Frozen Vermont maple sausage. Absolutely love this. I have this every morning and my kids mostly do too. Super good, tons of flavor, flavor with the maple stuff. So um, let's see, I got two packets of fajitas we're going to fajitas one night this week but i got two packets of the seasoning and they substituted the taco bell packet for the great value they were out of the great value so um i'm sure it's pretty much exactly the same but so i got two packets to make sure we have plenty and i always like to have taco seasoning in the pantry also so two packets of taco seasoning we were out so always want to make sure we have some I have some yogurt tubes. My kids love these. I freeze them and then they have them as dessert if they eat a good dinner. But really, really good. And this whole two, this whole pack, it has eight tubes in here. It's a dollar ninety-six, so pretty good uh, value. Great value, the brand. <laughs> um, I have some pack of green tea. So there's forty tea bags in here. I drink green tea in the morning. I don't drink coffee, but love my green tea. Um, Kodiak pancake waffle mix my kids love these they could eat waffles every day of the week so um, i started getting this one because it has more protein it has 15 grams of protein per serving so definitely love that want to make sure my kids are nice and full with a good breakfast um i get sugar-free syrup my kids do not like the full one which i guess is better but there's probably some not great ingredients in here to make it sugar-free but we get that one graham crackers another little treat if my kids eat well cheerios for breakfast for the boys and then this is their favorite uh, little snack right now is these pretzel twists and we were out and so they really wanted them and they were really bummed that we were out in the pantry so big bag of those those last us a couple weeks for snacks for the boys so here is everything i got or everything we're going to have this week. We have a crazy busy week. We have baseball three nights this week. So definitely we do a lot of just really easy, simple dinners um, to have on the table. We eat at home just about every night. I mean, 99% of the time we eat at home and I try and cook a nice good meal for the whole family each day. So Sunday, we're going to do chicken fajitas. Monday, chicken Caesar salad. As you can see, we do lots of chicken. Tuesday, we're gonna do spirals and meatballs, my kids' favorite right now. Wednesday, barbecue chicken and zucchini. Thursday, crock pot teriyaki chicken, which I'm really excited. Supposed to make it last week and we just got too busy, so having that this week. Friday, tacos and Saturday, I'm going to do crock pot garlic parmesan chicken. I made it a couple weeks ago. Oh my gosh, it is the best recipe I think I've made in a really long time. So I'm making it again. And I'm gonna add broccoli to that. I had a lot of veggies left over from last week. I had the zucchini and the broccoli, so didn't have to get that for this week. But here are the groceries. Here's the meal plan for everything we're having this week. Hope you enjoyed this week's grocery haul. Hope you hope it gave you some ideas on what to put on your meal plan for this week. All right, hope you guys have a great day and I'll see you next time. 